Hello, folks. Welcome to Leg with Ponzi. Hope you're as well. Hi. Hey, how are you doing? So, we're back with this behemoth. Now, this is a behemoth. It is so big, I've had to re realign the cameras, the, the, the boxes, and things. Now, this is just chunky speed chances box. It is a double pack. It's the largest double pack I've ever made. Of course, it's the Mercedes double pack. I've been sitting on this since March, but obviously due to other reasons, other things in life. I haven't got to making it yet, so here we are. Today we're making this. <laughs> I really am excited to see what this looks like and how big it is. I can see where it looks like, you know, what sort of scale is it? G63 is a big car, so I am quite excited to see just how big it is. Now, to compare sizes, that's the Mercedes, okay, large, big box, you turn it on its side, large, big box, okay, let's compare it to another double pack that I have, this is 76925, the Aston Martin double pack you'll see obviously it's ridiculously smaller in every way it's crazy how big this thing is honestly in speed champions terms this thing's a monster it really is i'm looking forward to making this today this will be another day take that away you don't need to worry about that today but yeah this is a beast of a thing it's going to be a lot of fun let's crack on with it shall we so we're going to start with the the AMG convertible. What's cat looks quite nice this one actually. This is only two bags. Just just put it out there. You'll see what I mean. This is two bags. You'll see what I mean. That's enough of an intro. That's enough talking. Let's let's, let's build some Lego.
So there you have it, folks. Lego Speed Champions 76924. It's the yellow coupe we've made today. The uh, black AMG 63 is coming next. Quite looking forward to that one. You'll see why when I explain it uh, in the next video. Uh, <laughs> it's uh, a bit special, that one. Very special, in fact. So let's chat about this one. Stickers are good. The detail is amazing. You've got um, printed brick for the centre console looking really good. The front end down here is all as it should be. It looks amazing. It's a proper looking radiator. You've got the little windshield, the, the, the body where the bodywork's all shaped. It just looks really, really good. It was a bit fiddly to make, obviously, because I've got issues in my hands. My coordination in my hands is not there at the moment, but that's due to, yay, for yeah, the onsetting um, health problems. Um, but yeah, it's it's such a lovely little thing. I want to get a little bit of yellow tile. I'm going to dig around in my box and see if we've got some yellow tile to pop on there. I'm not a fan of exposed studs. I'm just not. So I'm going to try and find a little piece of yellow tile to go on there. It doesn't come in the set. The set wants it as it's exposed. I don't want it exposed. So I'm going to pop that bit of tile in there, make it look a bit nicer. But that's just me. It's just the way I am. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this one. I enjoyed making it. I'm sorry it's took me weeks to get on, months even, to get around to making it. It's been out for quite a while now. Like most Lego is that I've got, it's been out for a while. It's just, I get it, and then I've got so much to go through before I get to it. So, anyway, it is what it is. Oh, and before anybody worries, yes, the Minecraft is still going on. Minecraft is coming a lot sooner than you think. A lot sooner than you think. Don't you worry. <laughs> See you all soon. Bye-bye for now. May the fun to be with you all, my friends. And please be careful in these seriously crazy times. Bye-bye for now. Ta-da! <laughs>